What's going on guys? So currently it is March the 24th. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna outline two futures contracts that you guys can trade going into the overnight session. Again, these are not gonna be swing trades. These are going to be scalps. So if you're not too familiar with scalping, uh, join my Discord, learn how you guys can scalp, learn my strategy. But with that being said, what I'm looking at here on uh, crude oil, so the ticker symbol for that is gonna be forward slash CL. I'm looking at the five minute time frame. What I'm looking at is this reconfirmation here of the 20 period moving average. I'm looking at a lot of consolidation in between the price of around uh, in between the price of around 111.54 and 111.87. So what I'm looking for, I'm looking to go long over 111.87. I just want to take that for a little ride here. Just scalp that along the way up. Just understand that we're going to have a little bit of resistance as we come into 11.98, which is a 10 cent move. But if you guys have traded oil before, you guys understand how fast this thing can move. And then obviously our resistance over 112. Definitely want to kind of clean up your position right around that 112 area. Your stop loss is going to be 111.54. Hard stop loss. It's also the 20 period moving average. Just hard stop loss. Just don't even think about it. Obviously, if this never confirms 111.87, then we would be looking for another setup. Uh, potentially a setup below the 20 period moving average, which is the 111.54. We would need that five minute candle to close and then the confirmation candle to kind of confirm that close. And then we would take that down. Next thing that we're going to be looking at here is the NASDAQ 100 forward slash NQ. I already put a, sort, a short position on, on this uh, uh, futures contract. Also alerted the people in the Discord for anyone looking to trade this overnight. That 14746 area was the area to short. That is my short position. My stop loss is up here, 14769. Now, if you've never traded futures contracts before, definitely, and you want to trade the triple Qs, meaning the NASDAQ, I would stay away from NQ and trade the micros. So that ticker symbol is going to be forward slash MNQ. You can still use the NQ contract uh, charting to go ahead and chart that. So if I kind of just pull it up, you can see what it looks like. MNQ, same chart, right? So we were looking for that breakdown, um, that macro breakdown right here, 14743 area. We got that little crack below. Um, obviously, we would want to use 14755. Just know that these are going to move $2 per tick versus the 25 on the forward slash NQ. Guys, if you guys are interested in trading futures and maybe you guys don't have uh, approval to trade futures on your current broker, or maybe you guys don't have the capital to trade futures, Definitely come um, check the link down in the description box below. I can get you guys set up on uh, through the prop firm that I currently work for and work with. Top Step definitely can get you guys funded up to $50,000, $100,000, $150,000 of real money, guys. We're not talking paper money here. Now, before you guys get too excited thinking you guys can just sign up and start working and get $50,000 in your bank account, doesn't work that way. You guys got to go through a training. You guys got to prove that you guys know how to trade. Prove that you understand risk management, have a strategy, you know, obey some rules, uh, go through a little bit of a trading combine, meaning that you guys need to do a little bit of simulated training, kind of show them that you can be profitable upon passing and completion of that training. You guys can get funded then through their broker um, with 50, 100 or $150,000. Definitely, if you guys are interested, just check the link down below that they can explain it a lot better than I can. Um, just make sure and let them know that uh, you're coming through me. Uh, and if you want help on how to trade futures and you guys want to go that route, join the Discord. I'll definitely help you guys out. We can trade futures together all day long. With that being said, guys, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Getting a little bit of bounce here on the MNQ. Uh, obviously, the 14754 area is still going to be the level of rejection, 20 period moving average. Have not closed above it, but uh, definitely subscribe to the channel. Throw me a thumbs up. Let me know if you guys do take the leap of faith, try to become a funded trader. Uh, definitely, you know, what happens a lot of times is people know how to trade, they don't have the capital. And then people have capital, meaning their own their own cash, and they don't know how to trade and they go and blow it. I would never suggest anyone to go lay down a ton of money trading futures if you have no idea what you're doing. Um, definitely can get yourself hurt that way. But until next time, I'll see you guys all on the next trading video.